Boeing's 777 airliner. Aerodynamic, and thanks to composite materials, 5,800 pounds lighter. Now Boeing is speeding up the composite process with a new cutting edge lab that doesn't do any cutting. It's actually, it's bouncing into the part and coming back out. It's called non-destructive inspection. If you've ever gone to the hospital to have an x-ray to find out whether your arm is broken, you want to know that before you cut it open to do something to it, and so you're doing a non-destructive inspection. The structure is composite materials submerged in a water tank. Composite materials represent parts of future planes. So let's look at that part. Non-destructive inspection has been around for decades. The new technology is using a robot and sound waves to do federally regulated testing allowing technicians to see with sound what's happening inside the part. It's not unlike when you go to a canyon and you yell, hey, and you listen to it come back. That's exactly what we're doing with that little silver piece that's on the robot. The software Nancy Wood and the St. Louis team are developing using their lab robot is going into systems inspecting aircraft parts and plants around the globe. These are the non-destructive inspection robots in the Seattle and Charleston factories. They are nearly 10 times the scale of the St. Louis robot. Here, a robot is testing a hat stringer, a composite part for inside the 777's wing. We've always done really good inspecting the parts. Sometimes we required many secondary inspections to get the right answer. Now we're really pushing to make sure that with the primary inspection, we get all the data we need to, say, to verify that yes, this is a good part. Good parts move to the production floor. The combination of the non-destructive labs and factory testing facilities is getting parts to their destination faster. It's been really beneficial for us to be able to reach back to St. Louis for the expertise and also for us to be the eyes and ears here in the Puget Sound region for what the customer wants and needs. And saving time. It really becomes more of an economic benefit to everyone involved. Saves money and lowers production costs.